Welcome back to PartsFaster.com. Today we're going to show you how to rebuild your fill and flush valve. What you're going to want to do first is turn off your water and flush your toilet once so you don't flood your bathroom. Then we're going to start with taking off the uh, float ball and rod here. Just unscrews. Set it off to the side. Then what we're going to want to do is take off the trip lever. It is reverse threads on this. All right, take it out of the hole here. Take your nut off. Put it down, up in the diagonal. How you get it out? Now what we're going to start with is we're going to take the replenish tube off from the valve stop. We're going to take the valve stop off. This also comes in the rebuild kit. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take the top half the flush valve out. All right. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take off the red seal down there. It acts as a flapper for your toilet. So we're going to pull it to one side and pull it up. Now what we're going to want to do is start on the fill valve. I'm going to unscrew the nut here. Everything, the nut comes with the repair kit. Take off the cap and lever assembly, which is the blue cap. Take off the plunger. And we're going to take off the seals here. You might need a flathead screwdriver. Sometimes they can be hard to get out. Now, since we got everything out, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to put it back in. We're going to start with the fill valve here. You're going to want to put the seal with the hole in it in first. Push it down. Then we're going to put the one that's flat and no hole on it on top of that. Then we're going to want to put the plunger in the middle. Now we're going to put our cap and lever assembly on. There is a little tab here and there's a notch down here. You want to line those up like so. Then we're going to slide our nut on. Like I said before, everything that I just rebuilt this with does come in a repair kit. You want to snug it up, don't get it too tight on. Now we're going to start with putting our red seal back on. And you want to put it in the first notch. I'll stretch it over. You'll know when it's in that first notch when you can turn it. Like so. It should just turn freely each way. Now we're going to want to do. I'm going to put our top half of our flush valve back on. Put our valve stop on. Like I said before, it does come with the kit. Screws on there. Snap our replenish tube back in. Right. I'm going to put our float rod and float ball back in. It just screws into the bottom of this blue cap here on the leaf. You'll know it'll just stop turning when it's done. Now we're going to put the chip lever back in. Put it in and down. Make sure you put the nut on the flat side towards the front of the tank or the handle. So we got that up there. You want to put it back to the little hole of the flush valve. Like I said before, this is reverse thread. Take 
a wrench. Get it a little snug. You don't want to get it too tight. You strip it out. All right. That's how you rebuild your toilet. Thanks for watching.